Hello buddies, my name is Game Knight, and this is Divinity Original Sin 2. I'm going to uh, visit one of my friends in a co-op for uh, just one uh, drop-in multiplayer episode. And I hope you guys will enjoy this. This is with Barden Plays, and you can find his channel in the description below. So before we get started, I just wanted to show you guys how you can create a... Uh, a shared game even though you're playing a single-player game hit escape and choose the connectivity menu here you can choose to have invitation only friends only or anybody so this is who can actually join your game anybody means anybody in the lobby of multiplayer can actually see your game and join it I don't recommend this setting because this could be disruptive uh, if someone comes in and takes your items or kills your characters and you need to kick them and reload. Just don't don't bother with it um, unless you want that to happen. I, I don't know why why you would. Friends only if you can trust your friends to uh, to not go in and disrupt your your game. It's maybe a good way to I don't know clean up. Your friends if they do invitation only is probably the best one because that means you need to have an invitation sent out to someone for them to join you can also uh, allow other players in your local network to find the game or direct connect if you have the server ID you can add players here so with this it will open up the steam overlay and you can hit invite with your favorite people when people come in you uh, hit escape because it will just randomly assign a character if they haven't joined your game before so you go into the party management and here you'll see the uh, person in question here or the persons you can have up to four and you can move the characters around so you can add uh, this guy down there to one player and this guy down there to another player so that way you assign who actually gets to use who. Whom? Whom? Who? Whom? I don't know. Um, yeah, so that's it. I'll um, get on with our drop-in gameplay with Barton Plays. Hello and welcome back to Divinity Original Sin 2 with me, Barton. And today I have a special guest. Hello. My name is Game Knight. I'm sure most of you know who Game Night is, <laughs> especially if you if you like this game. Yeah, and if you if you're watching on on my channel, because I'm gonna put this up on my channel as well, um, as sort of a, a guest appearance in Barden's Let's Play, and uh, he just started out, and I I thought this could be fun, so let's see how yeah. that goes. <laughs> <laughs> I can okay, so the wreck havoc in your game. Yes. Yes, you can. <laughs> I can make it rain. Oh, very nice. Maybe you put out the guy that's on fire, Burrow. Nope. <laughs> Bur Burrow is still he, burning. Yeah, apparently. Burn for eternity. <laughs> but, um, so we just finished, for those who haven't seen the previous episode, we just finished the fight against Burrow and Kana. And I think Lose has um, Burrow's club. So, oh yeah, I, I need to that, send that to Red to Prince. The Red Prince. There yeah. we go. And she has some money as well, and a stained shirt. Cool. She can keep the stained shirt. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I I I really would like to know what the stains are. It doesn't show. It doesn't say anything I, about that. But okay. I have to say, I wouldn't want to know what the stains were. <laughs> <laughs> you find that there's something really disgusting. I, I just hope it's blood, <laughs> but I don't know. Yeah. Blood's maybe the, the, the best the best, the best uh, guess. scenario there. <laughs> maybe, okay, maybe some, so yeah. okay. we're going to record um, one episode, so I think um, we should just go and find something to fight. Sure. Maybe the best thing to do at the moment. So, um, so I, I'm pretty much... Although I've seen your stuff, I'm playing blind myself, so yeah. I don't know where to go for what would be the next kind of level fight to go. So if you maybe lead the way. I could, I could, something I could do feel. that. Yeah. Okay, cool. Sure. Come, come this way. We'll okay. uh, 
we'll go talk to um, to Griff, and of, of and whom you him. just killed some <laughs> some guys. <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah, it was his his buddies, but he doesn't he doesn't really care. A delivery. Surely you'll oh, cool. have one. Sounds like my kind of guy. <laughs> so you you have uh, Stingtail here. Yeah. And uh, he was asking Griff if he could get a shipment. Just one. Okay. And and yeah. we don't know what that actually is. But what the shipment is, yeah. Yeah, so so take a chat with uh, don't yeah. tell anyone where you with got Griff. This. I'll listen in. Okay, so... What? He what? works in a kitchen. <laughs> yep. Potato peeling camp boss Griffin. <laughs> Are you in charge around here? <clears throat> Who's asking? Just a fellow inmate who asks some questions. He smirks and holds the little knife up to the light, watching it glint. Okay, so he's a bit of a psycho. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so let's see what what good options we have. I don't know what your alignment is, but yeah. Uh, at the moment, my alignment is towards fun. Oh, okay, it's <laughs> so good. Whatever, whatever <laughs> ends up fun. That's a good alignment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, Give him uh, two. Yeah, I'm going to ask him. Um, do you know your your thugs are terrorizing the camp citizens? <clears throat> thugs? <laughs> Look at it this way. People get lawless here, and we all starve. <laughs> As if he isn't lawless. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's see what's going to give us something interesting to do. I don't really want to trade with him. Nah, just uh, um, ask him about some stuff. Okay, so um, maybe a job, yeah. Yeah. I hear I hear you're a good friend to have. Maybe you have some work for us. He points the tip of his blade at the grisly sight of the elf hunched over, clutching his knees in the cage. I solve my own problems. Okay. So uh, he looked at the the elf over there. So if yeah. we want to, go we could go him. talk to him instead yeah, because he so. seems. A bit reluctant to uh, yeah. to give you any work. So there's there's an yeah. elf here. So prove ourselves to him first. Oh. He doesn't Listen, want you talking I to him. I can help you if you just... If I just what? Shut up, elf. <laughs> <laughs> he seems badly injured. Why is he being held here? This clown. You caught him stealing from my kitchen. <clears throat> Still won't say where he stashed my supplies. Sound like someone you'd let off with a slap on the wrist. Mm -hmm. How'd you know he's the culprit? Caught him red-handed trying to make off with a second crate after he took the first. <laughs> Went down like a rent boy when we grabbed him. Easy. <laughs> okay. He's <laughs> proud of that, actually. Yeah. <laughs> what an so idiot. what did he steal from you? Supplies. A crate of food. A citrus in particular. <clears throat> He'll talk. Or he'll die quiet. Okay. How about I find the stolen supplies for you and then you let him go? All I want is my supplies. <clears throat> Happy to let this clown die in a gutter instead of my kitchen. Bring back my crate and you got yourself a deal. Okay. Um, yeah, that's what we'll sure. do then. Yeah. Don't want to piss him off. Antagonize him. No. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe later, but not yet. <laughs> Maybe later. So, uh, he talked about citrus. Yeah. And, I mean, I, I could guide us uh, in the direction. I don't know how much you saw of, of the I, game. I, I saw you doing it um, in the, the beta. Okay. Doing this mission. So okay. So, we, we can... I know what it's about. Uh, it actually marks Stingtail on our map. So, that cool. makes perfect sense. It, yeah. That he is So, where a... should we go now? He, uh, oh, Stingtail on the map, he's a person of interest. Yeah. So we could go talk to him. Okay. Does she have 
pet pal in your no she has far out man and yeah thrifty okay cool so she's actually your bartering lass or do you have higher body bartering on i think the red the prince might have like plus two in that oh, okay so yeah there's there's sting tail here and if you use yeah. oh you use uh cool okay this man is a dreamer. As you know, I need a word with him. You may wait here while I speak. So yeah, now <laughs> this is um, related to the origin story of the Red Prince. So yeah. if you choose to not let him have a word with him alone, yeah, you might antagonize him. So he yeah. might leave your party. Um, yeah. So it's up to you, actually. I've um, never seen this. Yeah, I'll just let him... Get on with it. Indeed. Okay. <laughs> Mission indeed. I love how like both um Sabil and the Red Prince like are just they're not people you'd 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 want to kind of sit down and talk to. And nope. If you met which them. Which he does in a and awkward manner. The dreamer then chews and swallows a handful of Drudene leaves what? before slipping into a trance-like state. Whoa. He falls asleep. To your surprise, the Red Prince lies down and follows suit. After about half an hour, they wake up and begin to discuss what <sighs> they saw in their dreams. Oh, cool. <laughs> so, All like, right. shared dreaming. Yep. The Red Prince pinches the bridge of his nose in apparent irritation before turning his back on the jabbering dreamer. And, okay, mm. he got irritated. Yeah. So he didn't like what he saw. <laughs> I'm not gonna say the thing about the afternoon nap. No, because they've been they've been sniping at each other <laughs> since I started the game. <laughs> awesome. I couldn't help but overhear some of the nuggets of wisdom um, you've just received. You receive a withering glance in response, <laughs> and none of yeah, those were good. A bit of sarcasm, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> but though this Stingtail fellow may be a less than stellar specimen in the firmament of dreamers, the dreams themselves prove to be quite elucidating. That's okay. good. Turns out I'm being hunted by an enemy I didn't know actually existed. The myth-shrouded House of Shadows. I hope it's not the actual house that's hunting him and it's people <laughs> from the house. <laughs> It'd be weird to have, that was like, very, turn yeah. a corner someday and some house just yeah. comes, al comes alive. <laughs> <laughs> the dreamers, though, That's a thing, are on though. my side, <laughs> and they visions of me on the throne. Oh, I did. I somehow I I disliked the Red Prince even more after he got his voice. Yeah, so weird. Yeah, because I suppose it shows how good the voice acting is. Yes, he's supposed to be someone that you dislike. Okay, so I wonder if you're throne has worked the assassins that seem to come with it of course it is i was born with the promise of an empire and that promise will be kept but to keep it i must find a second dreamer a greater one a more experienced traveler of the dream world bahara is her name and she resides in the swamplands east of the fort okay so, let us make our escape and venture there post haste well, yeah, like making your escape, that's just going to be really easy. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that was that was basically um, the next part of his quest. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So if you look behind here, there's a uh, crate. Over to here? Over there. The marked crate? Yes. This looks like the crate I'm after. Okay, but, but there's nothing the in contents? it. Oh. But maybe... Stingtail. Somewhere around here. Can I ask him? Try. It, this is this is her target. She she was sent yeah. here to kill someone, and okay. that someone is Stingtail. Um, cool. it, that should actually show in your. Um, that might be yeah. why he's actually tagged. So yeah. so yeah, that's a bit of a confrontation in itself because you yes. have the Red Prince and Sibyl. Whoa! So uh, four, 
I think it should, yeah. it should be four. It has to be. <laughs> oh, yeah. State your name. Mm -hmm. I am Stingtail. <laughs> Who is asking? Why, it's Sibyl, of course. Don't you remember me? Sibyl, is it? Have we met? <laughs> I don't seem to <coughs> remember that name. Though there's something familiar about your face. Your cheek. Your How cheek. about my magic staff something thing and to <laughs> hit you with? He <laughs> goes quite pale. <laughs> Confound my drug adult brain, it is she. You're she, the master's chosen. Why do you seek me? Okay, um, I seek to be free. Scar first, the master second. Scar first? Is that, oh. is that why you seek me? I, I was made to weave it. They forced my hand. I never had a wish to to blemish you, enslave you. Really? Yeah, you say that now. <laughs> I would undo it if I could. Oh, I surely would. I surely would. But I cannot. Only the master. Only the master can. Okay, if the master's the key, I need to find him. So, where is he? I... but I don't know. How could I? The master finds he is never found. You must know that. Surely you know that. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna grab him by the the throat and um, use some enhanced interrogation. <laughs> Stingtail writhes in your grip as he gapes at you with fear smothered eyes. His voice a pitiful wheeze through his tightened throat. Please, I don't know. The whereabouts of the master. Okay, I'm gonna drag a nail across his cheek. Your nails dig oh. deep, and Stingtail's blood flows blood copiously, flows. as if eager for release. <laughs> but he doesn't speak a word. Okay. Oh um, my gosh. <laughs> this is getting really. Yeah, weird. That, that's <laughs> wow. I think um, I'm just gonna finish it. Okay. So yeah. we're gonna um, to stick the point. With the dagger. He squirms hysterically, yeah. <laughs> futilely trying to back away from the steel that pierces his flesh. He shrieks. No, stop! The wolves. Oh, cool! The lone you did it. Wolves. They may know about the master. Cool. Um. Okay. Tell me more the now. Master. He's been using lone wolf mercenaries ever since your escape. You vanished. So he needed others to do his bidding. They may know where he is. Lone wolves need to be paid in person. They may know where he is. Oh. Where can I find lone wolves around here? I... I... Who would know? Who would know? Must be Griff. Yes, Griff knows. I assure you. Cool. Okay, I'll He's over yonder Griff. in the kitchen. The cook, the celery man, the butcher man. But, but, but he knows things if there's wolves on the prowl griff will have caught their scent i've told you all <laughs> told you all i can holding a bloodied hand over his bleeding oh. belly stingtail stands before you a broken mess <laughs> quivering with fear and pleading <laughs> miserably to spare his life yeah what I would Sibyl be... do um I, I would be merciful, but I think Sybil would kill him. I think she's she's very, very mad at him yeah. for doing <laughs> what he did. It's your decision. She's going to kill him, but it's a case of which way. Oh, okay. <laughs> Will she do it quickly or slowly? I think she maybe has a little bit of sympathy for him yeah now mm -hmm. that he's explained himself so that's why she's going to kill him quickly yeah so not pain Blah. <laughs> 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 wow that was a a totally different outcome than uh, than you i got. had in, in yeah. mine wow impressive and i'm going to loot his stuff here and you can check <laughs> his body then yeah Oh, you're talking to... Okay. The narrator's just... Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So, what has he got in his body? He's got some... 
an unusually large orange <laughs> that even when you look at the picture, it looks like it has something stuffed inside it. Oh, maybe. <laughs> maybe it does. <laughs> maybe it's where he keeps his gold. <laughs> I want to oh. talk to the Red Prince as well, so I think, he's probably I think, not happy. Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, yeah, he did. <laughs> Demon elf, I should do unto you as you did unto him. Uh, let's see. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna grab his arm and wrestle free because these two have been his waiting to like going at it. Get at it. The yeah. harder you struggle, the tighter it grows. You're actually beginning to worry. <laughs> okay, <Your kid laughs> that's what she right do. Where you wanted it. <laughs> Red <laughs> right in the wincing, nuts. <laughs> but the fury in his eyes remains undiminished. Oh, you they tell don't like why. each other. I will tell him though. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Extensively. Yeah. It's simple. Stingtail scarred me, so I scarred him. Extensively. There will be a reckoning, Sibyl. Killing gives you too much comfort. You'll be your own needle, you'll see. Okay, cool. And then um, I guess we head on back to Griff. Yeah. Yeah, that we was that was find... pretty cool. Yeah, we still have to find someone to fight though. <laughs> that was really cool. It, I mean, it's it, it was kind of a fight. Kind of. <laughs> Not. Sort of. And it one-sided, though. <laughs> <laughs> Just a bit. Dad, did you do the uh, turtle shit? Yet? No, not, not oh, yet. Oh, okay. That's next, then. Uh, let's cool. um, let's finish this one. Yep. And you can you can do the uh, Sibyl one? So, yeah, I'll do that one, and then give them the oranges later, I guess. I'm looking for lone wolves. And I have it on good authority that you're the man to Do ask you? about them. What authority is that? <laughs> I heard it from a dead lizard. Lucky fella. I'd have done worse. Anyway, lone wolves, you said. Question is, why would I interrupt peeling them potatoes to tell you about lone wolves? Let's see what we've got here. Oh, that's, a, that's a rough... Third question uh, or uh, yeah. answer might be too too much. Yeah, I think maybe the second one. Yeah. I assume you like your your privates where they are <laughs> rather than skewered <laughs> upon my needle. He recoils from you slightly, but then his face contorts in fury. You threaten me. You threaten me. You had better apologize, woman. Right now. Uh, we might I'm... not want to pick a fight with him. <laughs> Yeah, I think <laughs> she wants the lone wolves more than she wants to kick him in the yeah, lad. So. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Listen, I'm sorry. I didn't mean any disrespect. The hell you didn't. But you did the smart thing. So I guess I won't Ooh, hold it against you. Oh, that was her. close. Good. Now, listen here. I'll make it easy for you. You're going to dig into your pockets and fish out a nice pile of shiny ones. Fiddy you gold. do that. And I'll point you to the wolves. Let them sort you out. Cool. Deal? Okay, yeah. Yeah. Griff counts your coins with greedy fingers. I'll have to Should kill have you later then and take that really. back. <laughs> <laughs> now then. Lone wolves. Yeah, I know of one. A fella with the fetching name of Zalaskar. You forget my name. That magisters think they're running a tight ship. But their boat's as leaky as an old goat's nipples. Money goes out, contraband comes in, and it's Zalaskars who's doing the moving. Cool. Can you set up a meeting with this Zalaskar? Oh, but certainly. As it happens, he's coming by for afternoon tea. Afternoon tea, wow. <laughs> what? Of course I can't, you don't. <laughs> he's out there, in the marshes. Okay. The Does, so so that's you her... Him, you're going to have to give the Magisters the quest. Slip. Okay. What are these marshes? Bloody new arrivals. You lot don't know nothing, do you? No, we're new. You're the one peeling potatoes, not me. <laughs> he sighs dramatically. There's a whole damn swamp out there. 
the hollow marshes. A vile place. An evil place. Even the magisters don't go there. Sounds um, like a nice holiday destination to me. Oh, yeah. There's devils there. Others say there's freedom to be had. Freedom! I all like a dwarven latrine on a festival night. Full of crap up to the goddamn ceiling. That sounds... Nasty. Yeah, nice. Okay, other um, other matters and give him his yeah, oranges back. Yeah, that's enough bag. talking about um, latrines. <laughs> okay, so I found your oranges in very big and um, inverted commas. Griff tears into one of the oranges with both hands. Juice squirts through his hands as he desperately rips through the rind. Looks like everything's accounted for. Now the important question. Who's the thief? It's that lizard I killed, um, so it's all sorted. <laughs> I did it. Let, let the elf go. <laughs> he raises an eyebrow. 1450. Like someone did my job for me. Your Indeed. guy's free to go. He should be fine. <laughs> Eventually. <laughs> okay, cool. So um, you can you can release him Take from coin, here. From I the, guess yeah. he's, he's gonna. Done. Yeah, he's gonna talk. And okay. quickly. Okay. 850 oh, experience points Very and nice. you can listen Very in here much. if you click the On conversation the icon yeah. yeah i hold my end of the bargain i show you the way out okay well, i have something more to ask of you what do you mean Sahela, a young girl here i am her protector and she is she is everything a ruler a seer, a knower, a child. She cannot, <coughs> cannot be lost here. Yeah, he's not the fastest speaker. Um, no. So, what do you have in mind? It is for all our people, for the world. Okay. Give me your map. I show you the way out. A secret. Dangerous. But it leads to freedom. Again. Freedom! Yeah. <laughs> Favorite movie ever. You must pass it to the elves who still remain. Tell them Sahela is here. They will send help. Please. She is important. Okay. I go to her. I wish you good luck and I thank you for us all. Awesome. So He's that like, is that. That's yeah, the that the is. next thing you can do. Um, go to go to the cave over here. Yeah, where he goes to. So what what should we go and uh, deal with the uh, turtles? Let's go say hi to the turtles. Yeah. All right. Are they ninja turtles? Uh, no. <laughs> well, <laughs> sort of. They they hide in the shadows. Sort of. So which direction did you go? Oh, they are there. Yeah, Thank you can you. see on the map the blue arrow thing. I don't know uh, if you want to bring Ifan or... Uh, um, I think let's just go with the guys we the have three. now. Okay, cool. So that guy, the elf guy, he seems like, you know, in uh, movies when there's like a character that is dying, but... With their final breath, they're able to tell you all of the information yeah. that you need to know, and then they just, then they die. <laughs> that was that was uh, something I thought as well. He would he would just yeah, die heal over. at that point. <laughs> so there's a hidden chest right here as well. Oh, nice! What's in it? And a bow. <laughs> I don't know what what did you uh, make Sibyl? Oh, she's a caster. Yeah, oh, because cool. um, normally I play like I um, clerics or um, like in Final Fantasy, it's like the white mage. Yeah. I need a shovel. I don't have the right so. tool for digging. And uh, here, um, the red prince can actually dig that up because okay. he has claws, so he doesn't need. He doesn't need a one must put in due effort if one shovel. Is to reap the proper yeah. Reward. Digging like a dog. <laughs> Digging like a dog. So I've got some money. 
We got some leather armor. Oh, and that's good. A darling bow. Okay. What, what difficulty are we on? Uh, classic. Um, it's like the second. Yeah. The second difficulty. Yeah. Okay. Well, you went down a path. Yeah. Did you go up? Uh, no, it's uh, you go in under here. Okay. Oh so yeah, now I see it. Click yeah. Uh, yeah. in the blue. Yep, I got it. I like that how the how the terrain kind of weaves together like that. Yeah. There's so many different paths in one little area. Okay, so, so uh, here. yeah, and we can we can just uh, carry on, but uh, okay. If you wanna if you wanna take the red prints and burn away the poison over here. Okay. With his breath. His horrible breath. Oh. Sorry, it's you. got stuck in the conversation with Fane. Oh, okay. Surprised. Perhaps you're more buoyant than I suspect. Nowhere in this world is safe. A face that seems... I would normally... I could then... Yeah, I'm just clicking through it. I'll go through it again yes, yes. later. Do feel yeah. Free. By which I mean go. shout. He is a very funny character, though. He Fane. is. He's, he's <laughs> quite interesting he's, as well. He's and so I mean, sarcastic you could, and condescending. To yeah, just to and you everybody. could you could bring him as well if if you yeah. wanted to as a character. So if you go over with the red prince and uh, over to here, yeah, and, just and then burn. use dragon breath, is it? Yes. Cool. I think I set the chest off for as well. Better take everything out there. Got protected at least. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's done. Then we can move up. Oh, nice. So there's a clang up here. Yes. And we and got there's three some more characters you can talk to here. Yeah. Talk to them later. We're just gonna Don't pause. go anywhere. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Stay. And then we come to the turtles. Yeah, it's just auto save, so that yep. only means a fight that might kick your ass. It could be. So there's a big guy over there and smaller guys here. So we got turtle. So he's a small guy. Yeah. Big... Oh, that is a big turtle. That's a very <laughs> big turtle. Yeah. So uh, we basically just engage these guys. Okay. Like this. There we go. And they turn. Look at that. Yeah. Boy, they're transforming. Oh, they're blue now. Nice. Yep. I'll do another one. And encourage. Cool. And then end turn. And the big guy gets to... Oh, yeah. Impalement. Ow. Ooh. That hurt. Okay, now Red Prince. What can he actually do? So he's got his Dragon Blaze. Fortify. He doesn't need fortify at the moment. Um, I guess let's just try battle stomp the small guy. Yeah. Pop. I always try and take out the easier enemies first because then it's kind of less people to deal with. Exactly. Good. Uh, good. Good plan. And then let's just smack him. And go. he's, he's dead. Well done. And now Sabeel. Nobody like needs more. healing. Okay, so maybe flesh sacrifice to start. And then it's gonna give you extra damage and AP. Yeah. Okay, and then is there anything that she can do that's gonna be decent this round? I don't really want her to basic attack. Decaying touch, she has to be within range. So I think I'll just move her um, over here and end her turn. Oh, you attack. Yeah, oh. you, you, if you uh, hit one or uh, hold down shift or, I don't okay. know, but you, you basically attacked. Okay. If you, uh, you, just, yeah. you just need to left click to move. Oh, okay, that's what, <laughs> that's what I thought I did, yeah. I must have pressed. Oh, I know what it was. I pressed the. Um, I was looking at the basic attack, and I must have pressed it. Oh. Of just at it. Okay, so 
Sorry so, about that, Red Prince. She didn't do it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I can uh, I can put it out there, or I yeah, can put him out. <laughs> um, okay. I think just focus on these because I think he's gonna be okay. Okay. And he then might, we're gonna he do... might be very um. He might be very nice about things, but <laughs> he should be okay. I think I'm gonna do like uh, hail strike on cool. that guy because he's frozen now. Nice. So he can't move then. Exactly. And so then, then we I'm... can just deal with the small guy. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So Red Prince then um, move out of the. He doesn't have enough to get over there. No, but he can move closer at least. Yeah. So let's move him to here. And at least Sibyl is in blood, so. Yeah. She can use that next round. Oh, you, you keep doing the attack thing. I don't know why it does it. Because I'm just <laughs> left-clicking to move. I'm not actually selecting anything. Uh, does it does it have, like, an attack cursor or something? Uh, oh, yeah, there is actually a cursor on it. So okay, how so do if I change you have... that so it doesn't default to it? Yeah. Okay, so let's do... Well, she doesn't need Bloodsucker right now. So she's okay. Um, yeah, so... she hasn't really taken any damage yeah. though. So I'm going to do restoration on the red, on prince. red prince. Okay, good. And then. And the basic attack two, of her hits. will go through and into their vitality because they don't have yeah. any magic armor. So just go for that. Basic attack. On you. Yep. Okay. And then in the turn. All right, and then I can do uh, move there. Yep. Keep this guy occupied. Cool. And that is electrified. So don't walk into it. Don't walk into that. <laughs> <laughs> Just <Game> yet. <laughs> wow. <laughs> This guy has 25 health left, so um, I think the stomp, do I have the stomp? Fortify, shield bash. Fortify would be good now, maybe. Yeah. Because he's going to be bitten. Yeah, he's going to be tanking this thing. Fortify also puts out um, fires or burning. Cool. And it uh, shuts down poison. Stuff like that. So next, just on on himself. Yeah. Okay. Good so stuff. then he's got his dragon blaze. Yeah. Where's his stomp? Oh, it's on the cooldown. Okay. So I think just basic attack. Yeah. Sense. Wow. That was good. And then end the turn, save that for next time. Oh, he tried oh and to then run. he's run away, nice. <laughs> I think you can reach, can't you? The uh, ancient. To shoot him from here? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Nice. And then just do it a second time, I guess. Awesome. And do you need some restoration? Nope, she's fine. I would sure don't have to uh, do a third turn then. It's on a cool end. Oh, three anyway. attacks, nice. Yeah, and then I can finish Glory him off. Is mine. Smack! Nice. <laughs> oh, he's jiggly. <laughs> <laughs> he is, yeah, dancing around. Got electrified as well. All right. So how long will? Oh, there it goes. So yeah, it, that's it, luckily it? it doesn't last too yeah. long. So this so was uh, was pretty awesome. Has. It was, yeah. Um, I will have to go get now. going. Yeah, yeah. and uh, that was cool, you can yeah. you can continue from here. Yep. So awesome. I'll continue. I think in the next episode from here. Yeah. And see what what the big turtle had on him, and what Probably lies all beyond. There, though. <laughs> Thank you very much for uh, yeah. wanting to. Uh, to do this drop-in multiplayer with me. That oh, was, yeah, uh, it was that awesome. Was really and, good. Um, if you have time again in the future, 
Sure. You're welcome to come back. <laughs> I would love to. Thank you very much for having me. Okay. Thanks a million. And I'll see everybody next time. Bye. Thanks for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed sharing this experience with me. If you did, leave me a like and a comment down below. It's very much appreciated. Also, if you haven't already, remember to subscribe by joining the Nightly Buddyhood. Have a wonderful game night. Cheers and stay cool.